I'm just tired of being seen as a scary animatronic. Why do my friends get to be normal looking animatronics, but I'm stuck being one with sharp teeth, holes, and creepy eyes? Today was just rough. I tried saving a baby from a tree, but the baby was too scared of me to come down and I got bitch slapped by the mom. Good evening, Mr. Mutant. I'm here to inform you that you need to pay your rent by the end of the week, or I, 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 I'm going, going to fucking eat you! What? Yeah, have a good night. Fuck. How am I gonna get that apartment rent for the month and... I don't even have a job! Hey, you don't have a job, you say? Yes! Is your rent due? Hell yeah! Are you big and red and scary and may possibly be named Mutant? Uh, yeah. This commercial is low-key starting to be more scary than me. Well, we got the job for someone like you! At the Seasonal Spirit Halloween in Hurricane Utah, we are looking for a sentient animatronic to be one of the animatronics at our location that scares shoppers and customers. You're a scary animatronic, you're guaranteed to get the job right off the bat. Come be hired today. It is also legally required for me to say that this commercial can indeed see you through the TV screen. So Mark, stop fapping. Fuck. I knew they could see me, but anyway, I'll apply for the job tomorrow. I'm gonna walk in and try to get an application. I don't really like the idea of being a scary animatronic, but I may get paid really well for this position considering my physical appearance and will have enough for rent this month. Let's do it. Need a good night's sleep first though. Hi, I'm here for a job application to be scary animatronic for this fine place. Sir, you're hired. Wait, what? I don't need to fill out an application or have an interview or anything? You're exactly who I need. Not even background checks? I could be a criminal for all you know. I mean, are you? I mean, I stole a stick of gum once from a gas station. Wow, you're sick. That's low, that's huge criminal behavior. Although, it makes you more scary. So... I heard you are. What's your name, you freakazoid? Mutant. Oh, I like that name. Well, your first day will be tomorrow. We gotta figure out where you want to be. Terrific. Yeah, hope you enjoy your 15 bucks an hour. $15 an hour? Yep. That's not bad, actually. Yes, indeed. Ha <laughs> ha! Anyway, uh, see you tomorrow. Yippee! This new job is going to be very intriguing, guys. I'm just surprised you're willing to be a scary animatronic. I thought you wanted to be viewed as sort of like a gentle giant. That's what I thought, too. I mean, yeah, that's true, but get this. $15 an hour. Hey, Mangled. Oh, hey, Mutant. How's my best friend in the whole world doing? I'm doing okay, mate. Just doing my own thing, I guess. <laughs> nice, nice. How about you? Ooh, I got this new job at Spirit Halloween. I start tomorrow. That's so cool. What do you do? Oh, I'm going to be a scary animatronic. Scary animatronic, mate? Yes. Hope that goes well for you, mutant. Is everything okay, Mangled? Yeah, it's just that... I've never seen you as a scary animatronic type. Oh? Yeah, I've always seen you as an animatronic that's there for me no matter what, and understands me and how I feel and listens out for me. There's a reason why you're my best mate, after all. That means a lot to me, Mangled. It, it really does. Anytime. Yeah, to be fair, the motivation behind all of this Halloween job stuff is for money to afford my own apartment rent anyways, so, yeah. Ah, the American economy being a cunt, huh? Yuppers! Well, go make that bloody money. I may not like jump scares myself, but I ain't gonna stop you. <laughs> Will do, mate. <laughs> Alright, this is gonna be quite the interesting day. <laughs> Mutant, my boy. We found where we want you to be located in the store. Oh. Right there. 
Hey, I'm near the front of the store! That's right, you freakazoid of nature. It's perfect for you. Now it's time to start work. Okay. Alright, time to wait for some people to scare. Hey, Dad, can I get this Trump mask? Why do you want a Trump mask, sweetie? I want to scare people with it because Trump has a scary face. You little shit! Trump is my hero! Don't you make me whip my belt at the store because I'll fucking do it! Ugh, can I at least write idiot on the forehead to rile people up on Twitter like Green Day did at that one concert this year? Hell no! Don't make me ban you from listening to anti-government music! That shit is secretly propaganda for liberals! I want to be the big donut, Daniel. Why? You gotta eat the fucking costume? Exactly! Uh. You gonna even pay for that? I can't pay for it if it's in my stomach! Bar codes and everything! Alright, Chief, you're under arrest for shoplifting. What? I'm the goddamn chief! You can't arrest me! I can because, well, I just did. Let's go, sir. Oh, I wanna be Sally for Halloween! Nah, it's just me, faggot! <laughs> oh, Mark, you silly goose. What a charming but spooky store. Still waiting for customers, though. Ooh, it's my time. Even better. Teenagers. I just pissed my pants, guys! Oh, you gotta hit the gritty on that, bro! Yeah. Oh, you won't be very Sigma. You're right. Just gotta remain skibbity. Teenagers scare the living shit out of me. That one song was right. But anyway, I gotta scare some teenagers to the point where one of them pissed their pants. <laughs> to scream at my baby! Because I get paid to do that? It's my job. No excuses, let me speak to your manager right now. Okay. What seems to be the problem here? How the fuck did you do that? This animatronic of yours scared my baby! I demand attention brought to me at once because I'm the most important one here. The animatronics here are supposed to scare you. After all, this is Spirit Halloween, not... <laughs> Disney World. They were scary there too! Oh, wanna see my head come off? Let me speak to your manager! I'm gonna have to ask you and your child to leave, ma'am. This isn't over! I'll be famous through somebody recording this, just you wait and see! A whole bunch of Karens like me will come in and seek justice for me! <laughs> did you get that on recording, Jerry? Yes, Dylan, I did. Let's go upload this on Reddit. Okay. There you go, son. Got them all taken care of. Let's keep this going, I suppose. Scaring people is not family-friendly, mutant. It can shy the youngsters away from such a holiday-themed place. Then why are you here? Because Halloween itself is not family-friendly. I need everyone here to know that. I need something to complain about on X2. Don't you mean Twitter? It's called X, thank you. Now I'm gonna cancel you for being too scary. <laughs> I don't know about this man. It was fun at first, but now I'm starting to see the flaws of being scary. It's just not me. Not at all. Well, starting tomorrow, I'm gonna be me and see how everyone likes it. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Spirit. Hope you have a frightful Halloween. Hey kids, have a spooky and fun day here at the store. Hope everyone is enjoying themselves here. Hey sir, hope you are having a wonderful morning. Why are you not being scary? Being scary? Yes. Why are you not being scary? 
Or should I say, oh, what's that word I'm looking for? Hmm. Oh, let's see, it was on it was on the tip of my tongue. Oh, oh yes, horror. Where's the horror? The horror? Yes. The- I mean, okay, look. I don't really like being scary. I know I look terrifying and I'm an animatronic, but I've always seen myself as a gentle giant who's nice and chill to others despite my appearance. But I hired you to be scary. Now, didn't I? Yes, you did. So, I want you to be scary. I want to see constant jump scares. I want your jump scares to be in a YouTube clickbait compilation. Okay, got it. Be scary! Or, I'm going to kill you. Kill me? Ha <laughs> ha, just kidding. You'll just get fired. Now, be a horror sensation at once. That's going in my clickbait jump scare compilation! Same with mine, man. More money in my pockets. You think I would have had a better shot at paying my rent by being a clickbait YouTuber than being a spirit Halloween animatronic? <laughs> Is there gonna be anyone that walks in this building that isn't gonna be scared by me screaming at them? Look, Mommy! It's Bonnie from Five Nights at Freddy's! Well... At least it's finally somebody that isn't scared by me screaming at them. I don't know how much of this I can take, dude. I need the money, but I can't keep selling myself and my morals out. Oh shit, it's Tyler and crew. This might actually be fun and cool. Yeah. Oh shit, Mangled? Mutant, mate? Uh... It scared me really bad, mate. You know how I feel about jump scares. Oh no. <laughs> Not in the store, dude. Not in the goddamn store. Shit, shit, shit. Mangled, I'm sorry. It's gonna be okay. What, 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 why are you being friendly to a customer? What, what did I tell you? You, you are supposed to be scary. Get, get back to being scary and do your job. You know what? Fuck this. I quit. Like I said before, I'm a gentle giant. I'm only scary on the outside, and that's as far as I'm willing to go because I can't change that. I'm not gonna keep working somewhere that doesn't vibe with my morals. Then why did you apply here in the first place? Because I didn't realize fully what I'd be doing by focusing on my outer problems before my inner problems. It's not worth being scary if I hurt my own best friend, so I quit. God fucking damn it. Some alphabet soup I made for you, mate. I love you too, Mangle.